Hey there, this is Gabriel, aka Bor245, and in this tutorial, I will teach you how to use Fishlock by Billman87. Right, so go on Google, type in source, forge, fish, log. Click on the first website. Click on the fish log folder and click on fishlog199.exe. Wait for it to download. Open it. Click run. Locate chat log folder, which is in my documents, GTASA, SAMP. Then, this will open. This is Fishlog. You can edit the settings by clicking on settings and going through each and every one of these. First one, log on. You can enter your username and password so the program will log you into the game automatically. Fish size. Here, you can enter the minimum sizes of the fish you want to catch. If you catch anything below the fish sizes, they will be thrown back automatically. This is the amount of time that you have to wait before fishing again. Set it to 2000 if you have a rod, or 4,000 if you don't. Here, you can choose what you want to do with your fish once you've entered a 24-7 diner or bait shop. You can either display the fish, sell all the fish, or do nothing. Other. Here, you can set your lottery number. You can check auto if you wish to randomize it. Jury. Click on ignore to hide the jury or display to bring it up. FPS limit. You can set minimum and maximum FPS limits by entering values in this box. Keep in mind that you have to have the FPS limiter enabled. If you are a donator, this will automatically change the color of your car for you. So every time you enter a car, it will change the color to these colors. If you are not a donator, this won't work. Keybinds. Here, you can create and customize your keybinds. You can click here to disable all the binds. Note that you cannot run Chaos Binds or any other keybind program because they will not work. Advanced. Here you can enable or disable main functions. For example, if you'd like to stop fishing, you can deselect this box here. play. You can use this feature to immediately start playing either on server 1 or server 2. Website. This feature can be used to access the Crazy Bob's website, forums, stats, global stats, and the online map. Well, that's all there is to it. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below or send a message to me, Board245, on the forums.